Hello, Faith Leader, and welcome to Bright Time. Today's proverb is 3028, which says, A lizard can be caught with the hen, yet it is found in king's palaces. That is another thing that amazes him, because remember, there are four things on earth that are small and yet extremely wise. It says that lizards can be caught, but yet they're found in king's palaces. Hmm, wonder what that exactly means. I'm wondering in my mind if there's some way that you and I are leaders because God has chosen us to be those people that are leaders. And even in the midst of king's palaces or in the midst of any place of authority, in the midst of the greatest place that you can think of, there you still are as the Lord's servant. There's no greater calling, no greater purpose, no greater passion than serving in that capacity no matter where God finds you. You can be found in, in the smallest of places, and yet you can be found in the highest of places, in the highest of ranks, and yet your heart is still in a place that the Lord has you in the palm of his hand, that you are still that person that God has formed. And that, that is a great mentality. I see this as a, as a humble place because no matter where God finds you, you realize that your power is resting in the hand of God, that he, his hand is upon you, that no matter what um, name you have before your name, no matter what initials that you have after your name, you're still the same person because you realize that Christ is the one holding you in the palm of his hand. You realize that's where you get your authority. And boy, that's a tough one in the midst of a workplace, is it not? Because often in workplaces, it is... Is that it's the temptation is to assert our authority to become people that are um, powerful, that are known for our name, to become people that rise the rise the, to the top of the ladder. Not that there's anything wrong with any of those um, places, but ambition can get so much in the way of humility. It's such a delicate balance because God may not be the one calling you to that place. You might be the one calling yourself to that place. I might be the one calling myself to that place. So can I, can I be in a place of power and still be humble? Absolutely. But the way that this creature did it is knowing who's holding his power, knowing that he still is in the reach of the almighty God and that God has got him right where he wants him. And to realize that is the place where all authority comes from is in the palm of the hand of God. And boy, that sometimes it's difficult, difficult, especially if you have just a little bit of ambition in you enough that it, you almost convince yourself, this is enough that you can almost convince yourself that God's calling you. So that's just something we need to be thinking about. Are, are we still, have we realized that we are resting in the palm of the Almighty's hand, in His hand, in His authority, and that his call is for us to follow his authority, no matter where he's called you. So my friend, God bless you. God bless you as you rest in the, in the, in the authority of the Almighty God. And have a blessed day.